There are a few things in this world that hamsters like more than a fresh meal. In this video, we will discover 14 things hamsters love the most. Deep Bedding Hamsters are natural-born burrowers. In the wild, they dig through substrate to make a network of intricate tunnels for warmth, protection, and to sleep in. Their tunnels are often made up of several chambers, and each one has its specific use. These will include separate chambers for sleeping, to use as a bathroom, and to store food. Since hamsters love to burrow, you'll want to make sure you're providing your hammy with the opportunity to express their natural instincts. It is important to give your hamster at least 6 inches of safe bedding to dig and create burrows. The deeper the bedding, the better. A large wheel Hamsters are high-energy animals, and their bodies are built to run. In the wild, hamsters run up to 6 miles every single night to search for and gather food. They may seem lethargic and lazy during the day, but that's because they're nocturnal slash crepuscular. This means they naturally sleep during the day and are more active at dawn and dusk. Come sunset, you'll see the little guys scurrying around the cage and full of energy. A large wheel is an essential item in any hamster cage to help them get exercise and cover the miles of distance they would in the wild. Foraging Hamsters are natural foragers. In the wild, hamsters run long distances every night to explore and find food. Their huge pouches allow them to collect food from multiple sites before depositing it in the burrow for later consumption. Consider providing fun, nutritionally appropriate foraging opportunities for your small pet. This can be achieved by sprinkling their food around the cage or hiding treats in their bedding and toys. This will make your hammy search and work for its food, enriching their lives and helping them stay active. Dried herbs, flax sprays, oat sprays, and wheat sprays are some great options for foraging. Hiding Spots Hamsters are prey animals, and they find the most comfort in small, dark places where they can hide and feel safe. A hiding spot allows them to shelter when they are spooked or feel threatened. Make sure to provide your hamsters with several hideouts so they can have alone time and feel safe when needed. And remember not to disturb or enter their hideout as it's your hammy's safe place to rest. Having nowhere to take cover will make your pet scared, stressed, and anxious. Sleeping during the day Remember, hamsters sleep during the day and are more active at dawn and dusk. If you want your hamster to be happy, let them sleep as much as they want during the day. Whenever possible, clean the cage and interact with your pet in the evening hours when they wake up on their own. A variety of food Hamsters love a high-quality, high-variety diet. In the wild, hamsters would eat seeds, grasses, nuts, fruits, vegetables, insects, frogs, lizards, and other small animals. Make sure to provide your pet with a high-variety seed mix along with high-protein pellets. Keep in mind that most seed mixes sold at pet stores don't have enough animal protein, so you may need to mix their seed mixes with a high-protein pellet to get your pet the right amount of nutrients that they need. Things to chew on Hamsters' teeth grow continuously all their lives. They're designed to be worn down to the right length by grinding away at hard objects. Make sure to provide your pet with a variety of hard objects, such as wooden chew toys, walnut, coconut shells, or even cardboard to chew on. The more your hamster has to chew on, the happier it will be. Spreading their scent Like many other animals, hamsters are territorial creatures, and they love marking their territory by spreading their scent. Syrian hamsters have scent glands that are located on their sides, whereas some dwarf hamster scent glands are on their lower abdomen. In order to mark their territory, a hamster will often rub their bottom or sides across the floor or against cage furnishings. When they rub against something, a tiny amount of their specific scent is deposited on that area. This spreads their scent throughout their home, identifying it as their area. Hamsters also mark with their scent to signal to other hammies that they are ready for mating. A Soft Massage once you have gained the trust of your hamster, you can pet them with light, delicate strokes. Although most hamsters are solitary in the wild, these pets have since become affectionate and love getting attention from their owners. But remember, although most hamsters love to be snuggled, there are some that simply aren't big fans of being held or touched by people. If you have a new pet hamster, they may simply need time to get used to you. A Large Cage 
Although hamsters are small, they need plenty of room to exercise, burrow, and explore. Be sure to provide your hammy with an environment as large as possible with the enrichment they need to stay happy, such as sand bath, different substrates, and properly sized wheel. One scientific study done on cage size revealed that housing hamsters in small cages induce chronic stress. Keeping your hamster in tiny cages is unkind and can cause a range of stress-related and health problems such as obesity, depression, and boredom. Cardboard Tubes A fun item for any hamster is a cardboard tube that comes from toilet paper rolls or paper towels. Hamsters love to crawl through these tiny spaces and might even chew up the cardboard to play with. This is a simple yet effective addition to your hamster's cage that will stimulate its mind and give it something to do. Keeping their enclosure in a good spot Where you put your hamster's cage can have a bigger impact on their health and happiness than you probably realize. As prey animals, hamsters can be prone to stress, so their enclosure should be placed in an area where there isn't a lot of noise or traffic like where there aren't many people and young children constantly walking around. And don't put them next to the TV either. Stress can affect your pet's physical well-being in addition to their mental well-being. Likewise, make sure to keep their enclosure indoors, where you can control the temperature and keep them away from drafty areas. Sand Baths Wild hamsters originally lived in dry and warm places such as sand dunes, savannas, and near deserts, so it's natural that they'll enjoy a sand bath. Provide your pet with a container of pet-safe sand. Your hamster will dig and roll around in the sand granules. As the sand is abrasive, it removes grease, moisture, and dirt from their fur. Yummy Treats Healthy treats are certainly a way to make your hamster happy. It's also the perfect way to bond with your furry friend. When they realize that you're the one providing them with such deliciousness, they'll love you for it. But remember, too many treats can lead to obesity and a slew of health problems. Treats should never make up more than 10% of your pet's overall diet. You can feed your hamster treats such as apple, pear, or banana about once per week so they don't get too much sugar. Clean Enclosure Hamsters are very clean animals, and they appreciate a clean, nice environment. Dirty and smelly homes will create mental and physical health problems for your pet. Make sure to spot clean and remove visible debris from the cage on a daily basis. A complete cage cleanup is somewhat stressful for your hamster, so shouldn't be done too often. And remember not to use harsh chemicals in the cleaning process. Any product that contains bleach or ammonia is hazardous to animals. Make sure to use pet-safe cleaning products. Now that you know what your hamster loves the most, Make sure to make time to incorporate them into their daily lives to keep them healthy, happy, and engaged.